You are now watching Tales from the Grid. Never hurt me, will they, Brian? Oh, I can quit anytime I want. <coughs> <laughs> Moving on to Power Rangers, we've got the ultimate Dragon Sword in gold and black. We've got all five Power Rangers in vintage style boxes. I've got yellow, I got pink, I got black, I got blue, and I got red. Amazing figures. That retro triangle box, you can't really beat that. The fans get SDCC editions of previous releases. The SDCC reaction figures have retro style and packaging. Two new shirts featuring Japanese text. The Dragon Zord and reaction figures are repaints. Selling a pre-existing figure with physical tweaks is a way to sell the same figure twice. Selling a pre-existing figure in a new updated or retro packaging can justify the re-release. Convention exclusive and or branded products can increase sales. I'm not a fan of the black and gold versions, but at least the fans who are get another one for their collection. The retro style and packaging of the reaction figures is very hard to resist. Will I buy? The reaction figures I will. Dynamo. Awesome Power Ranger products. Go to super7.com today. We'll have these if there's some left over after the con. We have Ninja Turtles, we have Power Ranger Ultimates, we have t shirts, we have pins. Go to super7.com right now. The fans of the black and gold version get another addition to the collection. Calling a product an event exclusive when it lacks the branding or exclusivity can displease fans who attended the event solely for that product. Selling a pre existing figure with physical tweaks is a way to sell the same figure twice. Convention exclusive and or branded products can increase sales. I'm not a fan of the black and gold versions, but at least the fans who are get another one for their collection. Will I buy? I'm okay. Dynamo. These figures have retro style and packaging. Some fans may be displeased that the team was re-released instead of other characters or villains. Redesigning the figures and the package in a retro style can increase sales due to nostalgia. This release was an unexpected but well welcome surprise. I wouldn't mind if they did this with the 7 inch figures as well. Will I buy? I already did. The shirt features the Dragon Zord with Japanese text, which is a reference to the show's Japanese origins. This shirt costs $30. The price of this shirt can be due to the materials and manufacturing costs of six different sizes. I like to see a shirt with a more involved design, like there are other shirts. Will I buy? I'm okay. This shirt features the White Ranger helmet with Japanese text which is a reference to the show's Japanese origins. This shirt costs $30. The price of this shirt can be due to the materials and manufacturing costs of six different sizes. I like to see a shirt with a more involved design, like there are other shirts. Will I buy? I'm okay. Thank you for watching another episode of Tales from the Grid, and until next time, have a good one.